What the heck is up, guys? Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't been around here before, hi, my name is Nika, and I film lifestyle, beauty, and vlog type content. So if you are interested in those types of videos, definitely hit the subscribe button because I'm going to be filming a lot more. Yeah, so I'm really excited, and hopefully this will inspire you a little bit because this is a Valentine's Day outfit idea slash lookbook try on video. So, okay, so let's change. Look number one here. Ooh, okay, girl. We are serving you some Jessica Rabbit, Valentine's Day Vixen, Bodycon, body yaddy yaddy. Um, I've been watching way too much RuPaul's. Uh, anywho, homegirl has been locked up all year because of COVID. She's ready to put on her best clothes. She won't kiss and tell though, so don't worry. Excuse me, Sandra D has entered the chat. She's about to go to that carnival to crush that cigarette in front of Danny Zuko. This is also my edgy rebel Valentine's Day. You know what? You're fed up with your trash ex. You are ready to hit the town, live it up, and be single. And you don't need no men, no women, all of the above. You're just a badass bitch, and you don't need anybody. Yes, yeah, you're gonna wear black and leather and just, ooh, work it, work it. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, but you get the idea. This is just an edgier look and I actually really like this. I am so here for it. This next look is serving me major Cindy Crawford manifesting the Pepsi sponsorship ad vibe. Uh, this little white crop top here, so cute. Homegirl probably just wants to go to a bar just to grab a little drink, something casual, probably pizza. Oh, look at that. She's good at tying knots. She's probably the first to tie shoes of her own in her own damn class. She's an independent woman and she just likes to have fun. And apparently she must live in California because with this outfit, it's not like she currently lives in Canada where it's currently minus 30 and it's snowing out because we're in the dead ass middle of winter, but she doesn't give a damn. This is how she's gonna rock her Valentine's Day. She's just like ready to go. Ooh, this next outfit, two words, Blair Waldorf. Oh yes, Gossip Girl. Oh my God, spotting something juicy this Valentine's Day. I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna submit it to Gossip Girl. I'm gonna call up Dorota because we are going out scheming, girl. Ooh, this is such a cute little off the shoulder sweater dress, super comfortable, very feminine. And I feel like Blair would be very proud of me. And I know with this off the shoulder neckline, Mr. Chuck Bass would not be able to resist that decollete, that freaking neck, whatever his kryptonite weakness is. We all know if we watch the show and she's going out. Continue their very dysfunctional love story. So let's go. This next Valentine's Day look says very Maria Maria West Side Story or would be the Be Mine Candy Heart in your little Valentine's Day package. She's a little sweet with this frilly wrap-up skirt, again, apparently living in California because there's no winter, clearly, in this <laughs> wardrobe choice. But yeah, we're sticking to this wrapped kind of theme and playing on softer pastel colors, super girly, a little Ariana Grande type vibe, and you need to take this girl out dancing this Valentine's Day. A bonus to wearing a wrap skirt is you can go to dinner and live your bloated fantasy and not give a damn. This next outfit says, look, I'm trendy, look at my monochromatic look, my distressed jeans, my half sweater. Yes, I paid money for this really <laughs> dysfunctional type outfit, but it's trendy. And you know what, I'm probably going to want to go to a trendy coffee shop or just a local place to eat, probably somewhere with a mural get a cute Instagram picture, but don't worry, we're still gonna have a cute ass date. But yeah, this is for your girl who loves neutrals that just wants the pop of color in the lips. Now you may be thinking I am a little vixen looking for James Bond, but hell no! The guy's a player! How many girls does he see in one year? Hell no, I'm an independent woman this Valentine's Day, and guess what? I'm gonna dress up in my most lavish, I was about to say rags, but this is definitely the opposite of rags. It's a velvet. She's feeling expensive. Leave a comment down below which outfit was your favorite or which one you really want to try to recreate. Um, some of these outfits aren't exactly brand new, so I'll still put where I got them from just because the stores that carried some of these outfits might have something similar or something that you could easily recreate, honestly. 
So yeah, just let me know which one you like best or the one that you'll be recreating. And also, if you do recreate it, definitely tag me on Instagram. I would love to see your guys' creations and maybe you'll inspire me. Maybe I'll change up my Valentine's Day look this year. Also, if you really want to give your girl a cute Valentine's Day gift, and I'm not talking about your girl, I'm talking about your girl. <laughs> But if you would please give this video a thumbs up, when you give my videos a thumbs up, that really supports my channel and that allows my videos to be seen by more people. So I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh, and happy early Valentine's Day.